Hi, I'm, I'm Ron Zolkowski, uh, Director of Product Development at Team Wendy. Uh, talk to you here today about our, our line of Exfil helmets. Uh, basically starting with the Carbon, this was our, our first full helmet that we released. And we really started here actually at the, the inside liner. So this was a project we worked on with Natick Soldier Center uh, to a, do a new approach to impact liners. So instead of being foam based, this is polymer structure based. So we have the, the molded TPU structures in here. Uh, allows for a lot of breathability, but really was optimized for impact protection. So uh, when we had this, this liner come out of this Natick program, uh, we then transitioned it into the full carbon fiber shell. So this was our, our first helmet offering, uh, partnered with Wilcox. All our shrouds are, are Wilcox uh, precision machined. And we came up with our own rail system here, which uh, our goal was to make it more modular, make it so that you could DIY and attach really any kind of accessory that, that you could think of. Uh, we, we've got some new quick release quick release rails here we're showing uh, at SHOT. So it really all started for us with the carbon helmet. Uh, then we moved on into last year we released the LTP, is the, the lightweight tactical polymer version of the helmet, so it's injection molded uh, Lexan polycarbonate. And this is very similar to the carbon, you know, lower price point, uh, a pad based liner, still has the cam fit retention, which is, uses the BOA dial so you get on the fly adjustment, uh, locking cams in all four corners, so that's the LTP. And then the newest helmet that we're unveiling here at SHOT is the Exfil Ballistic. So the Exfil Ballistic, really just taking you know, the groundwork that we laid with these helmets, going to a full ballistic shell. Um, it's gonna be under two and a half pounds, 3A, you know, nine millimeter at 1400 feet per second, uh, less than one inch of back face deformation. Those are our targets on this. This is releasing uh, essentially summertime uh, 2014. Again, we have the pad base liner, the same rail system. And uh, one of the unique things about this helmet is actually the boltless retention. So the rails are held on with your standard shroud hardware. You know, smaller, or less uh, effect on ballistic performance, but still meets uh, all military specs, 150 pound pool. And that's, that's the full line that we have here. So you know, visit us, teamwoody.com. Follow us on Facebook to get all the latest news on new releases. And uh, you know, we'll see you.